What's up everyone, I'm Zach the Pokey Collector and in today's video we're going to be opening some older collection boxes. Uh, I think these are from a couple years ago. Uh, we got a nice Leafy on V-Star box uh, with some fusion, I think an Evolving Skies in there. Uh, we'll start with these though. We have the Greninja V Union and the Mewtwo V Union. I have opened these before, they do have some pretty cool promos. I like how they have the jumbo and then the four pieces that make up the same art as the jumbo. Let's get into this without breaking everything. Uh, so much waste with some of these boxes. It's been nice when they come out with like the, uh, what was it, like the Alakazam box was a nice little one and the Annihilate box if I remember correctly. Either way, starting off the week with some fun. Got the four cards there and a code card there for you. Alrighty, let's see. So there's four packs in here and a jumbo. We have Evolving Skies, Chilling Rain, Vivid Voltage, and Sword and Shield Base. You always gotta pay the Vivid Tax, y'all. Uh, every one of these old boxes. I, I opened some recently too, last week's video, if you caught them. Uh, vivid and everything. I don't know what was going on with this set, but they were really pushing that chonka chew in the products. Alrighty. Ooh, stone energy, not bad. Let's see if we can get something good. Uh, like I said, I've been opening up a lot of these older collection boxes recently just because I got a good deal on a bunch. Now we're getting close to running out. A um, couple more ETBs and then we'll be looking for more product. Ooh, okay. The amazing rare Celebi. We'll take it. That is a beautiful card. I don't think I have this one. Into a non holo Terrakion. A hit on the first pack. I don't know if y'all can see that like texture that comes out of it. <clears throat> I think they only did amazing rares for two sets that I know of. They have the awesome little A with the colors around it down there too. I love it. I love the amazing rares. Um, I think they only did them for Vivid and Shining Face, I want to say. There may have been more. Uh, those are the only two I can think of. Uh, but all right, Sword and Shield Base. We still need plenty of hits from these. Uh, if y'all caught the uh, two ETB video recently, it wasn't the best. So we're hoping to get something fun from here. We got a Citrus Berry, nice Ghastly. Into the Salandit. Wooloo. Got a Switch Reverse. Hey! <laughs> into a Lapras V. That's actually a pretty cool V card, honestly. Uh, I really like the artwork. It kind of feels like hand-drawn, but not at the same time. I don't know. We will take it. I'm pretty sure we need both of those cards for Master Set, so we're starting off pretty well. What am I thinking? Gotta go with both guys last, especially with the Umbreon pack art. I do love Chilling Rain, though. Plenty of hits we're still missing. Um, and then, obviously, Evo Skies. We just need that leafy on VMAX ult. So if we could pull that, that would be incredible. Lucky energy. All right. All right, lucky energy. We're going to keep you up by where we put the hits. Maybe it'll bring us some luck today. We got another Lapras. A Blitzel. Rock Rough Reverse. And do a Slurpuff non-hollow. All right. Come on, Evolving Skies. Come on. You burned me so many times before. Just maybe not this time. All right, code card. We managed not to burn any of the code cards. I I swear, like, uh, I've opened up a lot of Sword and Shield era, and every now and then they'll just flip the code card back and forth, so you're never really certain exactly which way it's going to be facing. So I'll take it today. A nice Pikachu, Palpatode Reverse, to a Glarian Zapdos Hollow. Well, two out of four... Uh, for the first box is pretty dang good hit rate, I'd say. Now let's see if we can get into this Mewtwo. I think the pack selection is the same. Uh, I see an Evo Skies chilling. Yep, same pack selection. We will take it. I'm pretty sure these dropped at the same time along with the, uh, I want to say, Zamazenta box? Maybe a Zacian box? That might have been a different run, though. Got a nice code card for you. And that Professor Burnett randomly just hiding in the back of these. Uh, oh no. This Jumbo Mewtwo got a little uh, got a little warp there. But uh, 
Not too many people get go for the jumbos anyway, so not too big of a deal, y'all. All right, round two. Round two. Can we get a Chonkachu this time? We were able to pull that amazing rare, so maybe something good? I, uh, we got more Paldean Fates coming, y'all. Don't worry. I didn't want to just do it for every video, even though I really want to do it for every video, if that makes sense, because uh, I just want to open that new set and start pulling some of the chase cards that I just can't seem to pull. A nice Charmander. Chatot. Don Fan Reverse. Into a Zerudvi. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Gotta be happy when you get a V hit in the Sword and Shield era. Unfortunately. Alright, Sword and Shield base. Let's get us a Marnie Full Art, y'all. Rainbow Snorlax. Still missing some, some all the top hits from these early sets. I need to... When I go single hunting again, I need to uh, focus on these sets. Because I'm actually not going for um, vintage cards much until... Oh, sorry. Until I finish my Sword and Shield era set. So I need to focus on them. Got a Reverse Orbital Rare. That what you want. Twins on the Orbeetle. Thank you for that, Orbeetle. All right, let's see what we got from Chilling. So far, we're at one hit out of two packs. Pretty good. Something might be Pika back there. Might just be another V, or maybe I'm crazy. I love this Inke. I definitely have it. I just don't remember it at all. Just on a food run, carrying a bunch of food. We got a reverse frostless to a Metagross V. All right, we'll take it. We will take it. Two out of three. Let's see if we can go three out of four with another Umbreon pack art. If we can, we, we already do have the Moonbreon, luckily. But uh, if we could pull one, that would be really nice. Talk. Oh. I must have grabbed five, y'all. <laughs> Oh, uh, no Moonbreon today. We got a reverse Rufflet, though. <clears throat> Sticking strong with the uh, two hits per four packs. I think the Leafeon has five packs, though. So, maybe this is where the real luck will come in. Oh, nailed the camera, y'all. Apologies. I do that a lot. All right. We got a Leafeon box. Oh, no promo card back there. It might be in here somewhere. V-Star marker, no one ever wants that. Ooh, okay. We got two Fusion Strike, a nice Jumbo Leafeon. But then we also have two of all these guys. I did not know that. I thought it just came with the one. And a Chilling Rain? These Leafeon boxes are nice. If you can find these for a decent price, I mean, just these three packs alone, I feel like is like 25 bucks already. All right, come on Fusion Strike. We have never really got too lucky opening Fusion Strike. I think the I've opened definitely a handful of ETBs, and I have another Pokemon Center ETB uh, to open in an upcoming video, so maybe we'll pull a nice uh, Gengar, my favorite alt art in the Sword and Shield era. Or an Appleton V. You know, or an Appleton V. We actually uh, just ordered our final... Uh, Two fusion strike kits we needed it was just a full art and a gold um so yeah should be in the saturday singles we are going to master set fusion strike here soon whenever those cards come in uh they're in the mail somewhere so i'm very excited this is the largest set um pokemon has ever come out with in english that i know of it's like 284 cards something like that play in the noon reverse to a golem all right, one out of two hitters for uh, Fusion Strike ain't bad. Come on, Chilling Rain. I don't think we've gotten... Okay, we got a V from Chilling Rain. If we could get a nice rainbow today, <laughs> full art, you know, an alt art, maybe a gold, just something better than the V cards we've got. Would be nice. Ampharos Reverse. Nickelarian Slow King V. I think I do need this possibly, if I could remember. I do like the Galarian Slow King in this set. The alt art is my favorite alt um, in Chilling Rain, the Galarian Slow King. So we'll take it. We're getting Vs like crazy, y'all. <laughs> I, I swear there's other hits out there besides Vs. 
Um, they're just not in the boxes that I seem to find. I'm trying to pull something fun for y'all though, I promise. Fun for me and fun for y'all to watch. Because we don't want to just be the V channel. Alright, Zora. A rough lick. Come on, Evolving Skies. Zwellius Reverse. Ay, ay, ay. No way for me. Opponent hits. So I guess you can't complain. All right, final pack. Evolving Skies, Duraludon pack art. I heard that's where the lucky hits are because no one likes Duraludon, so we'll find out if that's true right now. And then more Paldean Fates and maybe some Paradox Rift, I'm thinking, uh, in next video coming out this week on Thursday. So keep an eye out for that. But baby, slack off the reverse. Core guys non hollow. Lucky energy did not help us out today. We did get two, four, six V cards, but the hit that took it for me today was the amazing rare Celebi. So if you liked today's video, <laughs> please leave a like, comment down below. Uh, why are you still opening these Zacks? Stop torturing yourself, stop doing this. Um, but we're gonna keep doing it. <laughs> and I hope y'all have a great rest of your day.